Hi guys, let's do example for solving a linear system which has this form. This form, it's look like this, a x equal b. b this vector here and a the coefficient for this equation. And x of course the variable x mean here, I want to illustrate it more, x mean x, y, z w so they write it like this only x and some and they write it in bold way okay so now we we want to solve this a linear system why it's linear because here you you can see the order all of them equal to one and as we said before here you have to imagine here that here you have y multiplied by zero so you have to think it's look like this so so there is nothing here so it's equal to zero now the first thing we we have to write it in augmented matrix so first we have to write it like this a augmented matrix and it's look like this and here your b and of course this one it will change to the something and this one it's become RREF so our technique here we want to use it to make like if you have this a B okay so here if you have a B we want to to transforming it to like this R R EF. So I mean sometimes they write it in another not a B or C or anything but I like to write it in this way and here this it will change to something so I will write it to C and we will see later C it's mean like the solution for X Y Z and W so here we want to write it here this this one so it's look like this okay and here one two three four one two three four five okay and an augmented matrix we put here line or dot here okay and here the second row here one three five seven one three five seven and then eleven the last row here one zero minus 1 minus 2 minus 1 minus 2 minus 6 okay so as we can see here we want to change it to RREF so we have to do it so I want to put the leading one here we can see we have already here leading one so we have to make this one zero and this one zero to make it RREF. So in this, in the, if if they ask you solve the linear system, you have you, maybe you have many way to solve it. But in our course in a linear system, you maybe you only ask for Jordan or Gauss Jordan method or Gauss elimination. So you have two ways to solve it. So in this way, I'm using this way, RREF, which they called it George, uh, Gus Jordan. So here we want to subtract this row with this row. So because one minus one equals zero. And here the same thing, one minus one equal to zero. So here we have R2 minus R1, because we don't want to change this one, R1 goes to R2 and the same thing here we have R3 minus R1 goes to R1 R3 okay so this become this the same row we have to write it again one two three four five and then we have to put this line here then here zero we 
because 1 minus 1 0 3 minus 2 1 5 because subtract 2 rows here R2 with R1 5 minus 3 2 7 minus 4 3 7 minus 5 6 oh not 7 11 minus 5 6 here 3 yeah 1 minus 1 0 0 minus 2 minus 2 minus 1 minus 3 minus 4 minus 2 minus 4 minus 6 minus 6 and minus 5 minus 11 so here it's look like this now we have to think where is the leading one here is the leading one and the second one we have to go one step below and then go right until you find one and here is the, our one our leading one so here the same way we have to put the, the rest of this column equal to zero so here we have to think because we want to make this one zero and this one zero two minus what give me zero from this one so we have to multiply this one by two then we can subtract two minus two equals zero so we have to write it like this r2 my not r2 r1 because we want to change r1 r1 because we want to change this one r1 minus 2 r2 in r1 and here we have to, i like to put, put it like this then r3 r3 here what's minus a negative 2 with what it give me 0 so minus 2 plus 2 so we have to add it this one and this we have to make it 2 so here we have to write it like this r3 plus 2 this one plus 2 r2 in r in r3 okay so this change i want to I don't want to write it here I want to to write it here so this become so for the f the second row we don't want to change anything on it so here it's become zero this the same I rewrite it again and here the line the augmented line and here six and close and close this line okay so we multiply so we, i want to do this first so since we are i'm doing this so one minus or yeah multiply by negative two this one so let's do like this multiply by negative two so one minus negative 2 multiplied by 0 which is 0 so it will be the same 1 1 minus it will be 1 plus or 1 minus 0 to become 0 and here the same thing 2 minus this multiply by 2 so 2 minus 2 equal 0 3 minus this I'm um, multiplying here by 2 remember we multiply by 2 and we put negative so 3 minus 4 it give me minus 1 okay 4 minus 6 would give me negative 2 okay 5 minus 12 would give me negative 2 no 5 minus negative 12 
negative 7. Okay. And here the same thing, but here we have plus here. So minus 2 plus 2, because when you multiply by 2, it give me 0 here. And here, of course, this 0 plus 2 multiplied by 0, it give me 0, because 2, 0 plus 0, 0. And here, negative 4 plus 8, uh, 4, it give me 4, because we multiply by 2. So minus 2 plus 4, it give me 0. Negative 6 plus 6 give me 0. Negative 11 plus 12 give me 1. As you can see here, we have here, you can see this row. This row, if I want to describe it here, or if I want to write it here, let's look here. Since we have x, y, z, w, so here, as we, as I said before, this system, it's look like this, a, x, and of course, a, x equal b. And here, the, the a, the coefficient here, uh, this coefficient, I mean this coefficient, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, this coefficient, this a, and b, of course, what not be x x equal x y z w okay so here we multiply this this one by this one so th here x y z and you will see it later I will, I, we're gonna describe it more later but here uh, until now, we have you. You have to think like x, y, z. Here z. W. Okay. So here, you have in this row, zero x. Zero multiplied by x. You have to multiply it because, and you will see it later also. Plus zero multiplied by y and here 0 multiply by what we have z here or I write it here so here 0 multiply by w 0 multiply by w equal 1 and this give me because here 0 it's like 0 multiply by x which give me 0 0 multiply by y, it's give me plus 0, I, I'm, I want to write it plus, and here plus 0 multiply by z, it give me 0 also, and here 0 multiply by w, give me 0 as well, then equal 1, and of course it can't be 0 equal 1, this, it can't be, it can't be 0 equal 1, so from here, from this one, from this one, the system, the linear system, let's say that the linear system, you can see the system because this, it's called system because it contains many equations, more than one equation. Linear system has no solution 